How the f did the vaccines cause autism myth even start? This myth started in 1998 because of a British gastroenterologist named Andrew Wakefield, who has since lost his medical license and the ability to practice medicine. But he published a paper in The Lancet, which is a very prestigious medical journal, and claimed that he had data to demonstrate a link between the MMR vaccine, which is the measles, mumps, and rubella vaccine, and autism symptoms in children. The problem was he falsified all of the data in that paper. More than that, he used self-reports from parents who were planning to sue the existing manufacturers of the MMR vaccine. On top of that, he was trying to sell and market his own MMR vaccine, but because it was published in such prestigious medical journal, it took the world by storm and caused a lot of fear. Eventually, that paper was retracted, but that retraction did not occur until 2010, 12 years later. Now, in recent years, we're seeing measles rates above what we have ever seen in the U.S. And it is really a cause for concern because the very first measles vaccine was put on the market in 1963. So we have over 60 years of data that demonstrate that there is no relationship between vaccines and autism.